and today I am going to do a behind the scenes video on how I do my videos for my NASCAR Roblox reenactments. Now there's a lot of things I do. I specifically use private servers so I'm not interrupted in the middle of my video. But private servers are really capable of doing those things because they keep you from, well, they keep people from respawning your car when you're still doing the reenactment. And luckily, um, a lot of these games that I'm playing have free private servers, so it's not difficult to get one. Now, on rare occasions such as my Daytona, there's a Daytona game like this that has all the cars but they don't allow free private servers. Unfortunately, the price has been increased last year. So if you bought a private server before 2020 and you don't have 10 Robux, then um, your private server is gone. Like mine. Depression. But um, today I'm gonna just pick a random car. I'm not doing a reenactment video today since basically I just want to show you how I do it. So I'm just going to pick a random car. I'm just going to go with the Zero One Flex Seal because I love the Flex Seal ads because they're absolutely ridiculously funny. But sometimes on rare occasions, you see this like little block right here. I usually get rid of it. Oh, yeah, there's a shift lock for this. So you see that right there? That thing under the car? You want to get rid of that sometimes if you're doing a blowover. You'll click on it and it'll delete itself. Now you can bring it back if you want to. But in this case, I'm not gonna. But if you have that thing off, it actually makes flipping a lot easier. See, I didn't even like, I didn't even have to like hook myself. I could just immediately flip. Now, like my Ricky Craven wreck, you can see... You may be wondering how the heck I did that because I just went straight into the fence without any real, you know, like, evidence of it happening. But, oh, sorry. Fix that. I'm going to turn that block back on. Sorry, it's taking me a minute. Okay. So how I did that Ricky Craven flip, see that block right there? It makes you like actually go flying, like no joke. Make contact with it and you get yeeted beyond existence. But a lot of these times I usually flip on my own. It's actually kind of easy, especially if you're like in a grassy area. So all you have to do is just turn your car sideways really hard Watch the magic do the trick. Well, something close like that. Did not expect that. But a lot of these times, um, there's like these things that you can hook yourself with. I That's how I usually do my flips, like the Ricky Craven thing. And I'm going to show you how to do the Ricky Craven accident, for example. So I'm just going to drive and then we'll get there. Note, there may be some, like, stuff over here, like that. Ah! Whew, that was not expected. Okay, here we go. This is how I did my Ricky Craven flip. So, I drive on top of the block or just hook the wall. No! Okay, let me try that again. Okay, so how I do it. I'm just gonna hook the wall, for example. Just um, if you're like doing a, a crash where you have to like hook the wall, then hook the wall. I'm not gonna stop you. But this is how I did it. I launched myself. Sometimes you have to turn yourself in the middle of the jumps so your car like goes sideways into the catch fencing, not like basic sideways. You know, like not like sideways. How oh, I did it, but you know. Sorry, it's just um. I don't know how to explain myself, but, um, it'll cause the damage to look really realistic, 
And yeah, that's the behind the scenes video. I hope you enjoy. And like, subscribe, comment. Bye bye people.